Hello everyone, uh, this is just a very short video explaining how to give your enemies a smarter way of following your sprite around. Uh, I'm sure many of you have used this block before, the set my sprite to, or my enemy, to follow my sprite. But if I put this in, if there's a wall in between my enemy and my sprite, the enemy doesn't really know what to do and it just gets stuck against the wall. And it's not really what you want in your games. So with the use of two extensions, we can make our enemy a little bit smarter. So if you go down into the advanced section and to extensions, you'll need two extensions. The first one is, is it the tile maps extension here. And the next extension if you go up to the top, you'll need to put J Wonder with a U L slash arcade arcade dash tile map dash A dash star. And I'll put this down below the video in the description so you can copy and paste and it'll be a bit easier. Press enter and get this one as well. And now what we can do, a pretty simple block, grabbing the on-game update every 500 milliseconds. And then go into scene, scroll down to the bottom and there'll be new blocks here. Grab out sprite, my sprite, follow path and drag that one in. Change my sprite to whatever your enemy is called, mine's my sprite too. <laughs> Then back into scene, down to the bottom, and the path from to. So we need that one in where it says item. And the very last step to go into the tile maps extension, the new one we have, and drag out location of my sprite and put that in the to section. Then grab out another location of my sprite and change that to your enemy's name or mine's my sprite too. And you can click on the plus at the end here, you can change the speed it will follow you at. But now if we look at our game, my enemy will walk around the wall and it will chase me a lot better than before. Yeah, so Hopefully it makes your enemies just a little bit scarier in your games.